Yo, today we're checking out Ark Knights Episode 7, the penultimate episode of Season 1, and I'm really excited to see what's going to go down in this episode, and as well as the finale, so I'm really hoping it sets up for Season 2. I hope they don't do a different chapter, like a different story for Season 2. I hope it continues right off of Season 1. Either way, I'm excited to see more Amia, more Rhodes Island, and just what's going to happen, so let's hop in. What's going on, what's going on here? Oh, that's right. Misha got taken, right? They, she's gotten taken by reunion, didn't she? And I'm pretty sure they want to try to get her back. So the whole thing is, is that she's the daughter of some, like, renowned researcher or something, right? So I wonder what exactly reunion wants with her. Thank heavens. They're happy? See, they're very... They're being very formal with her, like... Like, they don't want to hurt her. And this is Skull Shatter, I'm guessing. Who is it, bro? Alex? The man who went by that... Oh, it's a dude. I thought it was a woman behind there. It's my girl Hoshiguma, bruh. I love that shield. Doesn't make it right, dude. Yeah, but Reunion won't let that happen. Reunion won't won't be okay with somebody not joining them. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I get it. This is, you know, the government created this kid, you know, by going after them and treating them the way they did. Yeah, they're basically dividing the people. But Reunion's not the one that started that. Yep. The government started it by the way they treated people. And then the non-infected just followed along, you know what I mean? Which means they're complicit, but I wouldn't say they're evil. That's not true, though. They want coexistence. You're the ones that want to get rid of people. Dude, they, they got this kid in deep. Deep, bro. Yo, Texas. One of my girls. All right, so they got eyes on Misha. Yep, you got to tell Amia and Ro Rode Island. <laughs> So they saw her? Yo, that light sword, bruh. This girl Misha is not cut out for combat. I understand defending yourself, but this whole overall vibe here, not a big fan of it. Like, it's cool that he's teaching her how to defend herself, but at the same time, he is trying to get her to join Reunion, you know? And if she joins Reunion and comes up against Amiya and them, I don't think it's going to be a good, a good time. <laughs> Damn! Okay, Tex! Are they brother and sister? Because he said father. Before. We know her father was like a researcher. Oh. Oh, we got that large scale combat coming, bro. All right, 
bro. This is the penultimate episode. It has to pop off, right? How can she trust you? She doesn't know you anymore, dude. Yeah, I think they're brother and sister. I'm kind of getting that inference here. That's that's W, right? But the doctor. If that's the girl I think it is, she's the one that came to Amiya in episode one or two or three, whatever episode that was, and said that they knew the doctor as well. But now she has this person going after the doctor specifically. So if I'm right in that that's the same person, I wonder what their history is, doctor and her. All right, man, it begins, dude. Yo, this music kicking in? Let's go, dude. Let's go, dude. Okay. Axia, let's go. Nice, she avoided it. Take them out, Tex. <laughs> nice. Amia, the Black Arts. Probably not. Wait, she's supposed to stay there and protect her, though. What's she gonna go do, fight? Oh, bro, they don't look like reunion members. Who are they? Damn! Were they newly recruited? Oh, it's a big dude, bro! Oh, we got a formidable foe here, bro? Yo, he has black arts. Yo. Those are W's guys, right? I'm pretty sure. The person that was looking after Misha. Kalula? No, who is it? It's, is it W? All right, they're okay, it seems like. Just a little shooken up. Oh, boy. Nice, Oshiguma. Let's go. Damn. Going for a little ride there, Alex. I see. A, div a diversion. He got back up there so quick, bro. Is he gonna blow himself up? Bro. That's how deep they got this kid in the where he's sacrificing himself for their cause, bro. A foolish fucking cause this kid just killed himself for no reason, bro. Wow. Was that Amiya? Who what? It was Black Arts. Did Amiya somehow like materialize a new new like Black Art or something? 
Dude, kid died. <sighs> he just watched it. Was that Amia, though? Who was that? It was. I wonder if she's ever done anything like that before. Yeah, she's not. This is new to her. It was done out of desperation because they didn't want Doctor to die. Oh, I thought they were going to run because, like, one of their leaders is gone, but it just invigorated them to fight for their brother even more, dude. I feel like she got what she wanted. I think she wanted Skull Shatterer to get killed for some reason. I don't think she wants Doctor to die. I could be wrong, though. Right, and now she thinks Ami is the threat, even though, uh, didn't you just see he was trying to blow himself up and kill somebody? So now, I guess, all her belief in Amiya just disappeared because she believed in Amiya, right? But Amiya had no other choice. The kid was going to blow himself up and take people with him. I don't know, man. This was a crazy episode. It was the penultimate episode. It's meant to be like that. I can't wait to see the finale, though.